Welcome to this technical webinar about the ABC catalog software. Let's have first a quick overview about this software. The ABC catalog software is a composition software based on templates and on object collections with images as you can see on my screen and can send jobs to the engraving machine. Now let's start with the installation of this software. First of all, we created the ABC setup. I'm not going to do the installation now, but the installation is really straightforward. The only thing you have to know is that you need to have the administrator rights of your computer to be able to install. During the installation, it will also start the installation of the machine and the installation of the driver. It will ask you to connect the machine, to turn on, to turn off the machine. Then at the end of the installation, you go on your device and printers and you get here a GTS Smart Stream spooler. By the way, you can see that it is activated because my machine is connected and turned on. You see that I have a lot of different GTS Smart Stream then I strongly advise you to change the name and to give the name of the machine that is connected. Currently, I'm connected to the M20 IQ. Then I rename my spooler and I give the name M20 IQ. I click on OK and you can see that now. This is my spooler connected to my machine. Now the machine is installed inside Windows. Let's install the machine now inside the ABC catalog software. I open the software. To access the configuration screen, you need to click here on the logo on the top. Not everyone should be able to change the configuration. This is the reason why it is password protected. Right now, as I didn't configure the password, you just click on validate to enter inside the configuration screen. Here you have one element that is the machine configuration. You click on it. By the way, the ABC catalog is coming with the M20 Energy machine already installed. It means that you will not have anything to do if you install the M20 Energy machine. As we install the M20 IQ machine, let's do the installation. I'm choosing here the machine. I am installing here the M20 IQ machine. I validate. And then here I select the spooler that is linked to my machine. And you see how it is important at this stage to know which spooler to choose. And this is the reason why I rename my spooler and I choose the spooler M20 IQ. I validate. I select my machine M20 IQ. Now I close. Don't forget to validate. Okay, nothing more about the installation. Let's go a little deeper here inside the configuration screen. Here you have the availability to change the language of your software. Here you have the availability to change the language of your keyboard. Here you can change the unit millimeters or inches. Here's something very important. You have to know that the ABC catalog software could be run on a PC, but it is also working on tablet PC. And now here you have the screen server. You can add a screen server if you want. Configuration screen, we already saw that. Let's change the screen now. Here this is a screen specific for example, you can ask to have a fixed height of the font when you write a text. Now, if you uncheck this, if the text is too long, the font will get reduced. And this way, it is quite nice and very adapted to the personalization market. Same way here, if the text is too long, you will get a compression, but maybe not too much. And this is the reason why we gave a compression ratio and here we put 15%. Here you can configure the password of the ABC catalog. You can ask here 
to be able to repeat the job once or twice. Here you can decide how many lines you will get of objects per page. Here we decided only one line and this is the reason why you have seen on my screen only one line of objects. And here you can decide to change the depth offset of all your templates to the value you want. It could be negative or it could be positive. Next screen. Here you configure the input and output. Here you configure the zero values. Here you can add the fonts or delete the fonts. Same for logos. And here you can add a customization. For example, you want to change the customization of your ABC catalog. You come to this screen and you go and find the customization you want to have on your ABC catalog software. Okay. By the way, the fonts you have access here, you will get access to all the templates of the ABC catalog software. Then this is all what I had to say about the configuration of the software. Let's now have a description of the software. The ABC catalog software is quite straightforward. Of course, to demonstrate the ABC catalog software, you need to have a catalog. And this is the reason why we created the catalog based on consumables that we sell in our GraphGraph catalog. The first screen here, this is the different categories that we have. Right now we have four different categories. Let's enter inside one category and you find here different objects inside this category. By the way, you can see here the two buttons. You can change the page by clicking here and you change the page. But don't forget that the ABC catalog software is tactile. It means that you can use it with your own finger if you have a tablet. And here on the PC you can also do it this way with your mouse. You click and you drag and you drop and you change the page. Okay, here it is. Now I select one object, for example this one, and here I can select the template I want. One, two lines, or whatever the template created. I click on this template and I can change my text. Here it is. Here I can change the font uh, depending on the font list I selected. Now I click on next and here you get the preview of the result, the object and the engraving on it. Here you have an image that is giving the user an idea how to handle the object on the machine. And then I'm ready to receive and I can send it to the engraving machine. Okay, let's start to do another object. For example, once again, this keyring. This one, and you can see that on these templates, we have here one line, but here we can have one line and a logo. Let's select this one. Here directly, I can change. Then now I press enter and I go directly on the second line. And here I can change my logo and I can use this one. I can close. Here is the result on the object. Here I have the vice of the M20 machine and then I send it to the engraving machine. I don't have much more to say about the ABC catalog. You can see that this is really simple. Now one last thing about the ABC catalog. We created an easy way to distribute this different customization. You just need to put your ABC setup and your customization inside one folder. When you run the setup, automatically the setup will take your customization and run the ABC catalog based on the customization that is here. It is a very easy way to distribute the different customization.
This is the ABC catalog software. Thank you very much for your attention.